All right, what's going on, everybody? Hope everybody's doing good. Go ahead and go sleep real quick. Get this, get this nice little session going. go back over here towards these ponds and start to uh, start looking for bear seven it's their drink time and I'm doing pretty good man I'm in been looking forward to, to getting to today to do some streaming man I done some pumpkin patching yesterday with the family and well, I really wouldn't start out with this spot, but I found a campsite the last time I was up here and did not grab it, so... Huh. Figure we'll get over here, see if we can't get us a uh, get us a bear, and then grab that campsite, and then get to uh, exploring more of this uh, map here. Absolutely horrible for this. But we've been shooting some more bears here lately, so it does seem like they've been a little easier to find. Hopefully, we'll get up here and see a couple more. Or some elk. I mean, I'm down for some elk. That campsite, I think, is going to be very useful because I think if the wind's blowing the way it is right now, we can always use that campsite to get to this place from the other, from the other wind direction. Yeah, you and me both. I still have that uh, the four star. And you know the bad thing about it is, is when I first got the game before I started streaming it, I had actually got a four star bear, and uh, you know didn't have that mission unlocked. get up on top of this little ridge so I can see both ponds yeah. 
there's one right there. There's actually two. That one elk looked big too. So let's go. That elk looks humongous. Actually, they all do. Mm -hmm. I don't see anything. So if I keep coming up right here and going over, if we can get down to there on the top, that's what we're going to try to do. We're going to try to go right there. Yeah, in this game right here, them elk don't care one bit. And the bears, they, uh, they tend to just eat old bones and logs that's laid over. If we was to spook these bear, and when we spook the deer, if we was to spook these bear, I think we'll go after some of the milk. The milk look big. See them bear. I would think should be coming right down this right down this mountain. There's a feed zone right there. Let's uh Yeah, there they are. They're just right over this little crest here while I can't see them. Hopefully, they'll give us a shot. Okay, they're kind of walking away, so I wonder if I can get up in there. Mark it in the zone there. Come back and get that. Uh, my loadout for tonight is the. Uh, is the 350 guide rifle for my tier six of my bear, my elk, and then the uh, 1903 uh, 30-06. Uh, I really, really like that 1903. I feel like it's uh, probably the best uh, 
the best tier 5 weapon they have now. Slow down. I don't know why my computer does that. Okay, so it's loaded up. Uh, what's your favorite gun from the new update? I should try the 270 a little bit more, but. This, uh, we'll see what if we can't see what star these bear are we might man they was some big elk in that in that herd The one star. So he's over here and see if we can't see them out. I'll leave that one star bear. But now we snuck up on him, so that's a good sign. The two star mature. There's a five star. There's a three star. For some reason, I can't get him to pop up. Three star. Two. to mess this up because there's a group of them in there there's three of them that looks real big It's a nice one. That is a nice one.
Mm-hmm. I could call and just get him to come in. This guy to turn. Of course, the two star mature would turn to come over here. But we know he's high fitness. The two star mature, anyways. Well, I guess he could potentially. Okay, that's him. Just a couple more steps. Not that one, this one right here in these trees. Of course he's a bed down. Can't really. I just don't want to make a bad shot on him. Okay, he stood up. Okay, there he goes. Let's see what kind of blood we got. <laughs> It's all good. I'm hoping I didn't make a horrible shot right there. That was a five star elk. But I don't know. Didn't look promising. 
He was definitely hunkered over, but... Got air bubbles. Yeah, I like the 300 too. But, uh, I really wanted to just try something different. I mean, it come with another 300, but there he is. There's our five star. Oh, he just now died. We'll take that, though. We'll take that. I think he's going to give us a... a pretty picture. Take a little screenshot action of that. Oh, I've been shot that one once. Got him in the stomach. Five star, though. I'd say when I shot him, he was probably at just a four. I didn't even shoot him with the right gun. Shot him with a seven millimeter. We got him with a three fifty that time, though. He's going in the lodge. We'll take that. And then... Yeah, that was a nice one. And we're wanting to go... Right there. I'm going to go back and get this zone, though. If this bear is just going to keep hollering off, I'll go up there and throw a round at her. Just be slow as molasses and oh, the lightning. That rain really makes it hard to hear.
but that that's why I like the 30 out six. That's why I like the 30 out six. It's just a, it's a deer dropping machine. I drop that deer with just a, mainly a left lung shot. Oh, look at that. Them, look at them bad genetics. It's good. Let's get him out of there. I'll come back for that. Yeah, that's the biggest reason why I've been using the the 1903 because it just the drop power on it has been crazy. Yeah, no, I don't like tracking them that much. I don't mind from to run some, but I just I don't like getting lung shots and then they run forever. This campsite, so we can hunt this a little faster. Catch that lot in there. Yeah, just like the, like the boy. I really need to get back on that map some. Yeah, I think that map would be real fun once you, once you got to playing on it. This graphics on this game are amazing. Right, I want that one. I want that one in the back. He's got real bad genetics, and I need that. Well, these deer are just going to run right over top of me. Come on now, that one's got real bad genetics and I need him for a little task.
see if I've got this task. Yeah. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I don't think I've put down a bore with... There we go, there's two. I don't think I've put down a bore yet with one shot. Them muleys was going to run right over top of me. If I'd have let them. That would have been a good time to have a bow. I cannot wait till they put some archery in here. I do know I have to go over this to get to that campsite. I cannot believe I didn't grab it last time I was over here. Show you how not to go down a mountain. Well, I don't see your comment on the stream, cow. be right just dead looking where lightning's going to strike like that there we go now I'm quit trying to do that Yeah, I'd say they done took that out since you put sexy in the comment. You can't be doing that now. Can't be can't be showing love like that. <laughs> uh, well write something else on the stream so nobody thinks I'm crazy. I'm looking at my phone texting my buddy that's watching too. <laughs> so everybody probably thinks I'm just talking to myself. Is this just an outlook? I could have swore this was a campsite. <laughs> I 
No, I, I, I. No, I see, I see how it is though, Kyle. Just making everybody think I'm crazy. Still ain't commenting. Let everybody know you're real. I thought that was going to be a campsite. Look at, why would they have two lookouts right here? Back to back. I do think I am going to work my way down to this river and uh, walk back. Just to. Like some beautiful country right here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, if they took sexy out, I'm sure they'd have. <laughs> see, now I've seen that comment. That comment i seen. But the first one that you screenshotted is not there. <laughs> Some thick woods. This would be a good place I'd like to put a, a tree stand with a bow if they'll ever add them. I know it. Oh, I speak that. I don't care. Yeah, I wish. Uh, I mean, I'm really, I'm really happy with the, with the gun pack that they put in. But, I mean, one blind or tree stand or something. A man could hunt would be awesome. I'm sure. Now he goes. I'm sure it takes quite a bit to make it where these trees look like. And these trees right here look perfect for a tree stand. But hopefully the developers are working on it. Really dead walk through here. I 
We've caught in quite a few zones through here though. have to of course my dog's gonna bark If it's barrel, see if she'll cooperate and maybe give us a little bit more of a broadside shot. Now, I hear a bear. Is it the same bear? See, the creek's 80 yards. So she comes down to the creek. Need to be right here. just stopped it's like she knows I'm here We'll see what kind of shot that was. In the way she's still running, probably not a great one. Yeah, clear. And them bears are. And they're not just perfectly broadside. They are so tough. Like that bear right there, it, she won't die. And she might run down here, make a big circle and get right back here in this bottom and give me another shot, but that bear's not gonna, that bear's not dying. It'll be one of them ones I'll shoot again one another time and I'll have two shots.
tesão, né? I need to get on the Transylvania map and then get all the the stuff for the or I can take my camera out a little farther. I might I might have to do that on stream one day. That way if anybody else is needing it, which I'll just I'll have to look up a video or a map or something. tracks You would think that there would be some mule deer or whitetail on this river. As many zones of theirs as we found coming down. These are badgers. Need some of them too.
So now we're down here where we've been. Okay. Let's see, 10 o'clock. I want to go up in here too. So. We're going to go ahead and do that. Storm mature. Let's see. He looks kind of normal. He looks normal. She looked awful spooked. Just sitting there. Mm. I don't actually want to walk that way right now until that wind's better. I still have quite a few of them left, as you see. <laughs> I'd say a lot of them is uh, just tree stands, ain't they? This campsite, and I don't quite remember being up here. Oh no, this is where I sh that. Okay, yeah, I know where I'm at. Yeah, I do want to, I would like to sit down and finish the story out. The story's kind of cool. So I got no zones down here. I did here.
Let's so get up here. To this little hill. Should have a good sight on them. Don't want that one. We want that one. This 1903 does work. All these zones around here for whitetail and there's mule deer mule deer standing right here. Fifty one percent. Yeah, I'll take him out. Wind blowing. We can see if we got any any moose. Let's go. Down here. Let's 
Yang. 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 Untuk. I think we're just going to have to leave them be since there's such a young little herd. Then we're going to work our way down in here. There's been a four-star muley down here we've been watching for a little bit, so we just never know when he's gonna be a gonna be a five. There shouldn't be nothing up here on this hill at nine o'clock. That they should be working their way down towards the water. We're just gonna I'm just gonna inch a little closer. Sometimes the way that things render in, you'll you'll get real close to them before you. They actually ever pop up. Let's just hope that they're down here. I don't really mind that they take a little bit to age. I just wish that you knew. I wish you, like when you found the information on them, when you're looking at them and it says adult, it says, okay, like, here we go. These things are coming down here to drink. So like, that guy, he, he's going to be a big dude. My goodness, that thing's going to be big. Anyways, so like when it says adult, I wish it would tell you like at least maybe like two years. So it's like if you go to the encyclopedia, and let's say so those was white tail. They're adult from three to five. But are they adult on their 
are you looking at them at age three or are you, are you looking at them at age five? Really, the adult thing don't matter. It's just the mature because after year eight, they die off. So if you've got a four star that is an eight, you know, you know to go ahead and take it out. See, like he's a three star mature. And now is he a three star, you know, seven year old or is he a three star eight year old? Because if he's a three star eight, I need to go ahead and take him. But if he just turned mature, he has a really good possibility of being a uh, five star. But I really don't mind them taking a little bit because, I mean, in reality, if you play it a lot, it won't take you that long unless you're just solely just grinding for the one no <laughs> I knew he was big there's a five star right there guys Woo 200 yards away they're gonna walk right out through here and that gives us two five stars we're gonna put in the lodge tonight if we can pull this one off I'm gonna go ahead and pull the gun out Oh my gosh. Hang on. That was that was another big one right there. Five star. Three stars. So that's right there's our big boy. Of course, they're all going to now just walk in unison with each other. And you can kind of tell about them a little bit from their... I'm not that good at it yet, looking at their color of their fur. They'll all get out of the way of him. <laughs> Dropped him. Yeah, this is like... This will be like the fifth or sixth. I don't know. We'll have to see when I go back to the lodge. There's quite a few five stars I pulled out of this one spot, but yeah, if you're talking about the first five star white tail I killed, this is in this exact same spot. I'm excited about that. I didn't even think we had one ready. I, I knew we had a couple big ones, but I didn't think we had one completely ready to go. Take a oh, take a picture. Let's see, look up, smile. Everybody smile. When could you ask for a better for a better view behind that one? Dropped him with a right lung shot. That's crazy. Five five ninety five. See, I've got real good genetics in here. So normally I don't shoot anything that's not mature. That is a that's a monster. Four eighty two. That's a big one. Drinking in the water. That's awesome. Put him in the lodge. I didn't even think we had one ready. 
That's wild. That is wild. We'll see. This wind's just gonna be whipping today. I'm getting to where these black spots now here that I've not been to. Yeah, I'm definitely taxing it. Definitely. I've actually, I can take a lot of them off the wall now and, and put a pretty cool multi-mount of a five-star whitetail. If I, if I wanted to. Now I had no idea that that deer was even going to be ready. But there's also a, you know, there's a feed zone. Uh, he's also a uh, mule deer that should be he's either died off or five star now That's definitely my little honey hole for whitetail. I've got a lot of bone hanging on the wall from that spot. So we're on this road. We can also just stay on this road. Make our way to that pond we've yet to be to. And I think this one, if I put him up on the wall... I think that actually finishes off that one wall. The one I'm really excited to do is the, uh, I want to do the bear that's uh, standing over top of the moose. But finding a five star bear and a five star moose has been been uh, very difficult but that would be really cool multi-mount a fox and some pheasants and stuff wolf and sheep but predator hunting on here is just not the easiest thing
I wouldn't mind them putting in a pair of binoculars that you can kind of zoom in with. I mean, they do have them in real life. grass coming in to render yeah yeah just give it some more time I think that's probably the best bet just uh I think for the animals you don't hunt a lot you've got to when you do decide to hunt them you've just got to take them out that way you can start getting some better spawns back in there What's up, man? Yeah, this guy, this game is. I'm glad you come over from TikTok, man. That TikTok thing's been very surprising to me. Oh yeah. I appreciate the sub. I love getting to hear that. It's definitely one of my favorite uh, hunting sims. We're just trying to go down to a pond I've not been to to hopefully catch some stuff drinking. And then uh, probably go uh, I'll probably go back up to that cabin and sleep and see if that see if the muleys will show up Cause now I'm kind of curious if I've slept enough to age all them deer since we got that five star white tail for a little bit. I just didn't want to pop around that curve. <laughs> I love how the animals render in. Normally, like, I could, if they was something standing right there, I could see it. So I, as far as I can tell, if you're a rangefinder, is actually trying to range it and it's not just stuck you can see them now what I want to take a shot at 900 yards with the 12 feet a second wind probably not but so Just right down the hill here. And it looks like it might be covered up in woods.
But we should still be there in plenty of time. Catch uh, catch anything that drinks there. There if they're supposed to be. If it's an often. I hate rarely zones. I hate that they don't tell you that it's rarely. I mean they do when you go click on them but they don't like if you're looking at the map trying to pick a place to hunt. This, this walk feels like it's taking forever to get down here. So it's really off the path here. So I'm just going to have to go. I want to cut in the woods right here. Gotten a five star elk tonight. That was a surprise. Then got the five star whitetail. I really feel like when I stream, you guys are good luck. Yeah, I would think. I would think that would be a really good idea. That way, you're not. Because it takes long to get to get to different places. Whether you're driving the Jeep or... Well, this was probably a little disappointing. Let's get back up the hill. Whether you're driving the Jeep or walking, try to get to a stand and then you get there and it's a rare zone. And you're like, man. see nothing walked all the way down here now I'd like to get this is... yep gonna die nah, I knew it that's how you don't go down that mountain if you wanted to know but now I've got six out of ten all right well let's just do this Let's just do this. Yeah, see, there's three. There's three. And if I wanted to put this one here, it's the last one on the wall. But we're just going to do this. We'll just do that. And then we're going to go... To that cabin, we're gonna see if that if the mule deer are eating over here. It seemed like for a long time the wind was always perfect when it came to this spot. Yeah, normally I keep it on at all times. Uh, like uh. I don't think it helps you to walk around without it. Because sometimes them sounds are just so subtle. And you've missed them. But, uh, and normally I walk around with it all the time. Tail might be out right here. 
which when the game first came out, Hunter Sense was, it was too dark. Like, I mean, you'd want to walk around with it on, and, but it was just, it kept the map too dark. It kept the edges too blurry also. But, uh, a couple updates ago, they, they kind of fixed that, so. And two, you should have seen me trying to track my first deer without a hunter sense. That was fun. <laughs> I bet I shot four deer before I actually found one. They might not be down in here. I have another five star muley. I've only got one of them. That one three star mature that was down here, I think he's going to be a monster. Because he almost looked to be the same size. Yep. There's the mule deer. Now, if we can just. Come on now. Come on now. See now he should be Hang on. Let's go. <laughs> of course. Uh, let's see, I know some players who don't play with it on for the experience. Like experience in, in the game or just the experience of not using it? He's going to give us a beautiful shot, but I really want to see what that other one is. Now this one's coming back. Perfect. 
four star. And it this dude's been a four star for a while. I might go ahead and take him out. He's been a four star. We still might mount him at four. And he's been He's probably going to give us our best chance. I don't know. At five, maybe. I don't think we're going to take his four star out. Mm, I thought about giving him a Texas heart shot, but. We'll let him slide. <laughs> yeah, you can turn... You can turn the difficulty up to... I want to think a ranger might be the last one. And... I don't... But I don't think it gives you zones or nothing. I think it's just, I think it's just like real, I mean like true real life, which I, I don't, I play on Hunter, I just feel like the animals are just, they're not so easy to hunt, or not so easy to spook, let's put it that way. His horns went right in the ground. Yeah, nope. He'd have never turned five. I knew this deer had been four star for a long time, but at 79%, he'd have never turned five. So this was as big as this deer was going to get. So I think it was a a good thing. Should I mount this deer or should I sell it? Decisions, decisions. 425. Sure, hunter difficulty. He's a good looking deer. Right, we're gonna we're gonna mount him. We'll put him in the lodge. Alright, it's eight. Let's go. Oh, I'll tell you what, let's go look right here at this pond. Yeah, it had it had it had a nice set on it there. I mean, we can always take it out later if we don't if we don't want it. There's always deer right there. It never fails. There's always some deer right there. You seem like I don't care what time of day you come to this spot. And then they always hop up. And then they'll go over that hill. I don't know if it's like a little glitch. That deer looks really good. Let's see what we can do at 300 and something yards. Hi right, man, I appreciate you subbing. Have a good one. Wait a second. Now that one looks a little bit bigger. And that one don't look too shabby itself.
They look like good blood. They look like real good blood, though. So at 300 and something yards, about 320, it don't, uh, it don't necessarily drop them anymore. <laughs> like I said, it never fails, though. There's always deer right there. And then every time I've tried to get close enough to see what they are, it's just, they walk over that hill. And then they get over that hill, and it is thick. It's hard to sneak up on them. Let's see what kind of blood we got here. Medium amounts of blood, air bubbles, we can take that. As long as we see air bubbles. Now I don't know what uh it's um uh, right there is that uh is Ruiz's cabin. There's a campsite just straight south of that little pond and then I always see deer I don't know if it's like it's some kind of little little glitch or something or there's always deer right there it never fails what are you doing? got to feel that out you just now brought it to me? Yeah, I forgot. Awesome. I'll do it here in just a minute. It's a pain with him on. It's a hard pain with him on stuff. Three star mature. He'd have never had a chance, so. But that's a, that's a pretty good deer. Single lung. It wasn't bad. Let's go up here and look at Ruiz's cabin. Look for some. Uh, Look for some good old meese. The amount of ducks. Here, it's another good spot. What time does the bear? Nope. Drink again, seven p.m. Okay, let's do that. Let's see if we can't end in the stream on a bear here, or attempt to. Oh, we've got perfect wind for this, too. Right in our face. We'll see if we can't get us a, uh, get us a bear here. And then we'll try to, uh, we'll go up and mount the deer and the elk. And then we'll probably call that one a night. I'm anxious to see what that that five star looks like. I might do some rearranging tomorrow too before the stream gets started. I might make a multi mount.
This has been some real good hunts tonight, though. At least some days you get on this game, and it's... I don't know. Like, it, it's got a mind of its own. It's just like, nope, I'm going to be very difficult. With the last stream that we was on last week, this is one of the spots we come to. And we seen elk and foxes. We found this, uh, this bear drinking zone. Because I can't really find them in the mornings at, at 7. So we'll, we'll try to do the evening hunt here. Pretty sure that's something right there. I just got really unlucky and seen that branch move as soon as I pulled my binoculars up. It's looking like I got super unlucky. side of this pond had I think I had a rare bear drinking zone and the other side I was pulling up the wrong thing I try that I actually do that quite a bit I mean it's 740 they're supposed to drink at 7 so I guess I give them a little buffer but you know we've learned in this game so far that even because, just because it says 7 o'clock does not mean that they will be there at 7 and they might show up at 8 bad thing is, is I don't know which way they come from
Yeah, it does. I mean, sometimes you get lucky and they come into that rare zone, but a lot of times it's just uh, got to be at them oftens. This is so dark. <laughs> we don't run into the foxes. I don't know. Well, that one didn't pan out. Let's just go mount these animals that we've gotten. That's a, that's a good looking deer. I'll take that. And then really that's some big horn. Five star elk. Oh, it's just that. I can just put Put the elk here. And then let's go find a spot for the muley. Here we go. It's calm. No, I like that one. There we go. There we go. The lodge is getting it's getting a little full now. Let's get in more daylight here. There we go. I mean, do you do you think you, I have a favorite animal to hunt in the game? <laughs> I mean, if you just look down that hallway, gosh, I think I'm more impressed with the hallway. <laughs> but man, I really want. I either want this one. I can do that one eventually, but that one, just that one looks really good, especially if it was a five-star moose and a five-star bear. I think that would be freaking awesome, but yeah, if you didn't know I had a favorite animal to hunt in the game, just, just, come, just come to the door and just walk down my hallway. Five star. Five star. Now this one's just a three. Nope, I'm sorry, that's a four star. That's just a three. Another five. Four star. And then a five star. Yeah. Alright, 
Well, guys, I really appreciate you guys coming to the stream. I hope you have a good evening. Hope you kill lots of big animals when you're playing this. I will be streaming tomorrow or uh, 8:40 Eastern, just like tonight. So uh, I hope to see you in there. And until the next time, have a good one.